Hello and welcome to Otten Math in this edition of Otten Math. We're going to talk about the change of base formula. Very quick lesson. I think change of base formula is real easy and it's going to allow you to evaluate uh, logs that you would not otherwise be able to evaluate by using a calculator. So problem is in your calculator, your scientific calculator, if you end up with something like this, you cannot evaluate it because the calculators will only evaluate natural logs and then common, so this is a log with a base of E, and common logs, which are logs with a base of 10. So you can type in natural log, you'll have an LN button in your scientific calculator, and you also have a log button, and both of these refer to uh, logs with a base of 10 and logs with a base of E. No scientific calculator that I know of has uh, an ability to evaluate this expression, so we're going to figure out how to change the base in order to evaluate it using your calculator. All right, so here we go, very straightforward. I give you an example, and then I'll talk about three, two derivatives of this example. So I have log base five of eight. I can simply change the base to a common log or log of 10, right? And now I have log of eight over log of five. And if I use my calculator, I just type in log of eight and that's going to be divided by log of 5. And I press enter and I get 1.29 as my result. All right, so this uh, change of base formula, in this case I change it to a base of 10. Um, the base, original base, becomes the denominator, and this value here becomes the numerator as part of uh, the common log. All right, so let's talk about a couple of derivatives of that formula. The first is, and basically the, these are all the same formula. I have log base C of A is equal to log base B of A over log base B of C. So what we're saying here is we can change the base to whatever we want, but A and C, A goes in the numerator, C in the denominator. Uh, and I can make this uh, value something like uh, log base 3 of uh, 49 and then I can rewrite this as a log with a base of uh, 7, log base 7 of 49 over log base 7 of 3, which gives me 2 in the numerator and log base 7 of 3 in the denominator. Um, I'm not really sure why you'd want to do it this way at this point using these numbers, but I can just give you a, an example. Um, and this particular example, I change the base from C to B, but remember C now goes uh, to be the new, or denominator and A as the numerator. All right, second uh, uh, log function or change of base function is what we did when I originally presented the change of base formula, and that's just converting this particular log to uh, a quotient of a common two common logs. So I have log now let's say base 5 of 7, and that's going to give me log base 7, I'm sorry, log of 7 over log of 5. All right, and you can evaluate this using your calculator as well. I'm not going to do that here. And then also you have a button in your calculator for natural log, as I mentioned, so I can convert the same log expression, log base 5 of 7, to the natural log of 7, over the natural log of 5. All right, so just going through a couple examples, I have log base 7 of 4. That gives me log base 8. I change the base to 8. Log base 8 of 4 over log base 8 of 7. I know that the uh, value of log base 8 of 4 is going to be 2 thirds, right? I take the cubed root of 8, square it, and I get a value of 4. So if I re were to rewrite this log function in exponential form, I would say log to the two-thirds, eight, I'm sorry, eight to the two-thirds is equal to four. This value here in brackets is equal to two-thirds. I can't do anything with a log uh, base eight of seven unless I use a change of base formula to find out an answer. Okay, second log base seven of four uh, is the same as the common log of four divided by the common log of seven. Again, I can use my calculator uh, using the common log function. You should get a value of 0 0.712. And then finally, uh, log base C of A, again, is natural log of A over the natural log of C. So same example, log base 7 of 4 is the same as the natural log of 4 over the natural log of 7, and you get the same value, 0.712 as a result. 
Okay, that's it for rotten math and the change of base formula. Come and join us for some practice problems. We'll review all the uh, properties of uh, logs, condensing and expanding expressions, and also the change of base formula.